Hey, it's Alex with Tucker. In this video, I want to talk about our new Tucker Max output system. Uh, this is one of the systems we call Uniquely Tucker. Uh, this is our first five stage uh, system in over a decade and something that uh, most likely we'll see in, in the market. So let's take a deep dive. We're going to get up close and personal with the Max output and go over the features. First thing we're going to point out with our Max output is that this frame is not steel it's actually uh, aluminum so you know you'll have years of service out of this without fear of rusting and paired with the frame is our no flat uh, tires uh, wheels here so once again years of service out of those as well uh, we don't have any of those inflatable tires that would probably last about a season. Next thing we want to point out in this five stage system, uh, typically uh, you'll have your water connections hook up straight up uh, to your inlet going in your sediment. But here we want to point out our manifold here where it has your inlet. So this is where you connect your water to. And you notice here we have an RO than an RODI. So you do have the option with this valve here if you're in an area that has good water quality coming out of uh, the RO only you can switch it. As you can see right now it's currently an RO so you, you'll have make sure you have either uh, your uh, hose tubing or most likely you'll have a hose reel connected to your RO uh, port and then when you want to switch it to the RODI, just flip it over and have your hose connected to here. And here we have our uh, bypass valve. This is your wastewater. Here you see we have our heat shield. This is to uh, cover our onboard 110 plug in pump. We have this there just to to protect to you um, in case this gets hot and obviously we, all, we have water coming out of here so we're going to shield the pump from getting any water on it. If you move over to this side, this is where you have your your bypass valve. So right now it's uh, in this position, it's uh, in flush mode so you have water coming out of your the wastewater here. And then you'll flip it over and go in basically, you can say clean mode, uh, where you'll have it going uh, in the ROs and the rest into the DI. And just a quick note, uh, I get this asked all the time, you will always have wastewater coming out, even when this is in clean mode, that's just, just to help regulate the system. So moving above that, we have our pressure regulator. There you can see our easy to read pressure gauge and then you can adjust the pressure when you have your pump on right here. Moving over to this side, this is our dedicated on off switch for the pump. So you're not relying on the cords GFCI switch to turn on and off. Before going on to filtration, we wanted to quickly point out our onboard TDS meter. It sits here on top of our pre-filters. As you recall before, I had mentioned that you have the option on the max output to go between RODI and RO only. And if you want to check out the quality of your RO water, this is how you can do it. Turn your power on. As you can see, it's currently on the out, out reads DI. So if you click on the in, this will be uh, give you a reading out of your ROs by themselves. Now moving on to the filtration. So recall we said we had the water coming in here. So the water will then travel up to here into your first stage. This is your dedicated sediment filter. As you can see, it's labeled here into your carbon it says carbon this also features the chloramine killer and this is something we've been doing in our systems for a number of years now as uh, if you don't know um, 
a lot of municipalities are adding chloramines to their water treatment, which can adversely affect your RO membrane. So we want to make sure uh, you're pr really protected, not only just against chlorine, but also chloramines. And then it will move into your dual ROs. And finally, back over to here, and move into your 20 inch refillable DI cartridge. So there you have it there. This has been a review of our Tucker Max Output 5 stage system.